What if I told you I can predict who will win the World Series in 2014? I've collected many stats and created three points that I believe will prove to you that the Los Angeles Dodgers have the best chance at winning the World Series in 2014. First, the Dodgers have the best bullpen in the MLB. Second, the Dodgers batting lineup is filled with players that can produce and put runs up at any time. Finally, the Dodgers new front office is completely committed to fielding a team that has the best chance at winning the championship and they're willing to do whatever it takes to reach that goal. My first point is that the Dodgers have the best pitching in the league. And I can start off by talking about Clayton Kershaw, who's undoubtedly the best pitcher in the world. He's already young, won two Cy Young Awards, and he's only 25 years old. And he's also posted a league-leading ERA of 1.83 last season. The closest ERA to Kershaw's was 2.19, just to put into perspective at how much he dominated his competition. The number two and number three pitchers for the Dodgers are Zach Granke and Hunjin Ryu. Granke is a veteran and a previous Cy Young Award winner, and he posted the fifth best ERA in the league last year, which was 2.63. Ryu was a rookie last year, and he's a lefty with a lot of potential. He's in the talk for winning the Rookie of the Year Award for the National League, but he ended up coming up short. The Dodgers also have a great closing bullpen, making them virtually unbeatable if they are holding the lead in the 8th inning. They're led by new additions Brian Wilson and Kenley Jansen. Brian Wilson had 18 games with the Dodgers last season, and he turned in an unbelievable ERA of .66. Jansen posted a stellar ERA of 1.88 with 28 saves and 111 strikeouts, the second most out of any closing pitcher in the league. Jansen also pitched a perfect game last season over the course of 9 saves. My second point is that the Dodgers have a batting lineup that is stacked with proven veterans and game changers. Adrian Gonzalez, Hanley Ramirez, Andre Ethier, and a healthy Matt Kemp are experienced players that can determine the outcome of a game at the plate. Gonzalez is a very consistent player in the batter box and led the team in hits, batting average, and RBIs last season. When healthy, Hanley Ramirez produced the most at the plate out of every shortstop in the league. His 3 .45, .345 batting average and 20 home runs made pitchers think twice whenever he's at the plate. Both Ethier and Kemp are young guys that have been in the organization for many years. Ethier has established himself as a consistent hitter while also being known to have a clutch factor and performing in high-pressure situations. The only thing holding Matt Kemp back is his own health. He constantly struggled with injuries last season, but when he was healthy and feeling it, he was putting up runs on the board. Yasil Puig is also a major factor every opposing pitcher has to consider when facing him. The 23-year-old Cuban defector took the league by storm last season when his first week included a stellar game-winning defensive play, a multi-home run game, and a game where he recorded a grand slam. The rookie continued to impress at the plate throughout the season and in right field leading to him barely losing the NL Rookie of the Year award. My final point is that the Dodgers front office is willing to do whatever it takes to bring a pennant back to Los Angeles. After Frank McCourt's disastrous tenure as owner, the Dodgers were purchased by former Laker legend Magic Johnson, Peter Guber, and Guggenheim Partners in 2011 for $2 billion. The front office's commitment to winning is evident based on the moves they have made since taking over. Through trades and spending absurd amounts of money, the front office has brought in players such as Gonzalez, Puig, Wilson, and more, ensuring that the Dodgers are serious contenders in the World Series race. The Dodgers have a strong reason to believe that they will be claiming the title in October. They have a virtually unhittable bullpen, a batting lineup that can, get, that can score at any moment, and a front office that will do whatever it takes to get something that they want. Dodgers fans all over the world should be optimistic that the World Series title is coming back to L.A. for the first time since 1988.